Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on The Witcher 3. Uh, let's go ahead and head to the inn at the crossroads. Uh, find out about, uh, what's his face? Um, from the innkeeper. Maybe getting a little bit of a fight. Actually, I'll probably just avoid the conflict because it's pretty easy. Alright. Then both forces attacked. Probably should have just ridden to the town before, like, off camera, because these long horseback rides and long boat rides always, always, always do me in, because I run out of things to talk about. Guy hanging from a tree. Alright, we're almost there. The heck? I'm just gonna get off my horse. I'm just gonna get off Roach and Swim. I don't know where the bridge is. Oh, I think it's right there. Oh well. This works just as well as hopefully I can make it up this bank. Yep, okay, good. Alright, in at the crossroads. I'll not give her up, not on me life. Looking for a man. Goes by Hendrik. What do you want with him? Want to talk to him. What about? Give me a bottle of something strong. You gotta go. I'll open the back way for you. I haven't finished my drink yet. In Cape, vodka. Who's this? Un? Brave warrior, looks like. Got two swords, see? Oi, great boy. What's the point of having two swords? Wonder if he keeps an extra prick in his trousers, too. You fucking deaf. Gonna say who you are? Or do I need to loosen your tongue with me knife? I'm a witcher. Heard you wondering about my swords. Well, one's for monsters. The other, for humans. Only got one prick, though. In case you're wondering about that, too. Don't touch him. Don't even look at him. Worse than lepers, that lot. Saw one in action once. Killed a half dozen. Blood everywhere. Freak didn't even show a drop of sweat. Got the stench of corpses on him. If you want to rest, come with me. Or the bench you can use. I step in the hut, and there's the bull okay. with what looks like his son. That's a... Look at Bruno chilling in the corner. <laughs> Thanks for not starting a row with those swine. I don't generally poke my nose in other people's business. Looking to stay the night? No. Hmm. I'm looking for Hendrik. Man lives in Heatherton. Don't know where that is. Other side of the hill. Looked that away this morning and saw a strange glow. Imperials on the raid, perhaps. But who knows? Anything else you can tell me about Hendrik? Odd fellow. Arrived from who knows where and for no apparent reason. Shacked up with a widow whose husband was stabbed for a scrap of bread. Baron's men don't like strangers. Aye, and he stays out of their way. Always seems to know when they're coming. Always manages to disappear. Thanks, Inkeep. Okay, so now we gotta go find Hendrik. So I I pretty much decided on the uploads, uh you know, we're going to have Metal Gear Solid, which is going to try to be the daily upload. And then we're just going to we're just going to roll with uh, alternating days or whenever I feel like it, a Bioshock, Witcher 3, and um, Dark Souls. It's just going to be kind of some alternating stuff uh, where I'll alternate between games or maybe one day I'll have all three up on one day uh, if Metal Gear... Oh, crap, dude. 
Come on, Roach. But I thought about that, and I think that's probably a good plan. Um, because these games, I'm gonna try to have them last me a couple months, not months, but a couple, not a couple weeks, like a month, there, I'm trying to say. Get them to last me a month, uh, and then we'll kind of refigure out what I want to up, what I want to start uploading. But Metal Gear, Gear Solid 5 Phantom Pain looks great. I know it's weird. I should probably stop talking about it because this video is going to go up after I've already started playing Metal Gear and uploading it, so I should probably just shut up and stop talking about that. But there's kind of a lull without games between, you know, yes, September 2nd and, uh, like, some, like, mid or late October, I think. There's, like, this lull between games. So... I'll have plenty of time to finish this up, and I'll have plenty of time to... The Dark Souls one's not going to take long, to be honest. Um, I know what to do in Dark Souls, so... And you can pretty much skip a lot of stuff. You can move pretty fastly for, through that game, unlike Witcher here. Not that it's a problem that you can't move fast in Witcher, but... you got to follow the linear story, and that's about it. You don't have much other options. Like dropping into a deep cellar on a hot day. The mist. All right, come here. There we go. Come here. There we go. Any more? Thought I remember four. Be gone. Leave me be, whoever you is. Get away. Calm down. It's over. Aye, it's over. All's past, never to be restored. I'll not forget that ever. Looking for a man named Hendrik, supposed to live in this village. Aye. He did. No longer. They nabbed him in that hut. If you'd have heard the cries, sir. If you'd have heard how a man can scream. How he can suffer. Tell me what happened here, step by step. They took him. Took him all. The sun was waning, see, and the dusk went crimson like blood. Thought to myself, strange, the toads, I cannot hear them. Save terror through and through. Hendrix screamed. Then he begged. By the end, he could do naught but moan. Here long, the terrors. 
Yet the village froze like in the heart of winter. You in that hut when they rode off? No, and I'll not set foot there. Never. Farewell, and peace of mind to you. <laughs> okay. So now we gotta go over to his house. Check it out. Poor Hendrick. I'm gonna move this rug first while we're... There we go. There's a draft. Gotta be a space under this rubble. Guess I should do some cleaning. Okay, so let's examine his body now. Tortured him. Maybe they missed something. Need to check his pockets. Trousers are stiff, as if hung out to dry midwinter. Maybe hid something in his jerkin. Damn, he's cold as ice. Nothing here. Should check his boots. Blood, congealed. Key hidden in his boot. Gotta fit a keyhole. Somewhere nearby, hopefully. Down in the basement. Pop this open. There we go. Can I climb down? There we go. I'm happy to be back on Witcher. Like, I, I missed it. It's gonna be disappointing after this playthrough, because I'm not gonna play it for, like, forever. It's literally gonna be, like, forever before I play this again. Valuables left unlocked. On display. Almost... Lost his mind, or... Mm. Okay, let's push this thing in. Hmm, interesting. The Wild Hunter just a bunch of idiots if they couldn't figure that out. I'm sorry, Wild Hunt, but you guys... You guys are some idiots. A ledger. Payment for a sack of grain. Amount due for a charcoal shipment. Hendrick was masquerading as a merchant. Hmm, what's this? Notes among the ledger entries. Clever. Interesting headings. Missing and wanted. Subject appeared in Skellige. Also sighted in Novigrad. Appearance unchanged. Ashen hair. Scar on her face. Avoids contact with others. Drunken swine. So-called Baron hosted subject at his castle. Or should I say, illegally appropriated fort. Reason unknown. Talked to Baron at Crow's Perch. Clashed with a witch. Subject landed in swamp. Encountered a witch. Conflict ensued. Cause unknown. Find the witch. Talk to the peasantry. Village of Midcops. Caution advised. I'm being observed. Don't know by whom or why. Unsettling signs. Dog ran off. Water in bucket froze solid. Strange glow observed in the sky. Ill omen, peasants say. Somehow they learned Hendrik was looking for Siri. Thus the torture. I'm too late. My only leads, the Baron, and some witch. Damn. Okay, so, we got the option of Bloody Baron and the Witch. Let's go, I'm gonna go Kira. I'm gonna go with Kira first. Suggested you go Kira first anyway, by level, so. Okay, Roach. Let's go, buddy, come here. What the hell? There we go. Okay. Oh, this is a... It's a long ride. Damn it, I always suck at jumping fences. I gotta take the way out because... Like, watch, I'll probably just do it right here in the middle of nowhere. Yep, 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 see? I can just jump at will now, but I couldn't jump that fence. 
Okay, we're cutting through the woods. I think I can find her on my own. But I think it's easier just to go talk to the people and then get it on your map, but... Oh, oh crap. Okay. If I find the rock, I'll just go find her myself. Which I think... I don't know if... No, I don't think if I'm coming in from this angle, I'll find the rock before I find the town. I think you find the town first. But I could be wrong. I'm pretty sure I'm not. Actually... No... Yeah, well... Where is that rock? Oh, we're much... We're farther away than I thought I was. Okay, why are you doing this game? We're just gonna go through the woods like this. Hold on. She's up a little ways into the woods. Let's do this. God, my, the mapping is confusing the crap out of me. Here's the town. I don't know what the mapping is trying to do. Here we go. Let's try to jump. Fence. Killers. Got it. Okay, I need to talk to this guy. Looking for the local witch. Look for her then. I know nothing. Okay, um... I think it's this lady that I need to talk to. Gods. Should send him back to the witch. Might cure him of laziness. Greetings, ma'am. Good day to you, sir. Need something? Got a matter for your village witch. Know where I can find her? I don't bother with her myself. But ask my man. He'll know. Twerked his back so bad last week he could hardly move. So I sent him to the witch. Came back sprightly as a foal. Where is he? In the yard, no doubt. Pain's gone, but sleuths set in now. Should be hunting foxberries to feed our young uns. Marion's lad. Now that man, he knows how to provide for his family. Caught some water rats last. They had food for days. Good day. Heard you know where to find the local witch. Who told you that? Your wife. Daft wench. Leave me be and don't listen to that nattering sow. We've not had a witch, shaman, nor cunning wench in ages. You sure? Give it a think. Won't take no for an answer, will ye? Ooh, all right. Know the small pond near the village? Path leads off from it. Follow that till you come across a lone rock. Walk around that, then to the woods. Find the old cart. You're there. Thanks. It's just... Don't harm her, sir. Word of your kind's reached these parts. My kind, meaning? Well, the witch-burning kind. No need to worry. I'm not out to hurt your witch. Ooh, a weight off me heart, sir. She only arrived a short while ago, but she's frightfully wise. Even pleasant on the eyes, if you like them skinny. Thanks for your help. Farewell. Alright, Roach. Not so fast, Roach. Run, Gotta jump Roach. the fence here. Roach, you suck. Fine, I'll ride out the way the game wants me to. Oh my god, I can't. What the hell? That's it, Roach. We are. What the fuck? I am stuck in this stupid area. Fine. Okay, whatever, Roach. You useless idiot. There's supposed to be a large stone near the pond. There's the stone. Maybe by the time I play this for a fifth time, whenever that is, I'll remember where the stone is. There's the boulder. Now right, and onto the cart. Come here. Oh. The cart. Which is hut is somewhere nearby. 
Come here! You dick! Got him. Got him, coach. Miss, the cows are wheezing, won't rise from the barn floor, pus streams from her snout. Do I look like a dairy maid to you? No, miss, but you know things. Tis our last cow, none other left in the village. Rest died of hunger, or soldiers let him off. Oh, we're as good as dead without her. I shall give you herbs. Mix them with water drawn from the spring at midnight, then make the cow drink them. But first, you must clean out your barn, thoroughly. Is that clear? Thank you, miss. A thousand thanks. Enough. I've had my fill for the day. Go home. All right. She's in a foul mood. We'd best come back on the morrow. Watch what you say. Anyone home? I'm um, not even going to worry about examining stuff. I'm just going to loot. If there's loot, I'll loot it. Now, where she run off to? Yeah, let's pop this open. I remember there's some decent stuff down here. Some bread. Yeah, see. Decent stuff. Not the hell. I hate this game for this reason. They put so many c candles and crap that you end up just extinguishing crap instead of looting the items. Alright, where's the skill? Guess I'll loot this first. Powerful aura. Must be some artifact or. So this is where she disappeared to. Into the white light. It's so much different than the black loading screen that we're accustomed to. Well, well. Nice. I was wondering how long it would take you, Geralt. I'm upstairs. Don't be shy. Yeah, let me walk like a badass up these steps and get stuck on a step. Yeah. Greetings, Witcher. to spot hmm. where hope you didn't come to go no to talk turn around and wait Kira Metz deep in the heart of Velen. Thought you hated the countryside. I can assure you I do. Now more than ever. Heard a witch lived out here. Never would have guessed it was King Fultest's former advisor. I'm so pleased the world's still able to astound you, Geralt. I actually envy you that sense of wonder. Common in children, knights errant, and morons. Hmm, someone's grown irritable. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I believe I greeted you with a pleasant view. Now tell me what brings you here. I'm looking for a certain young woman. Oh really? Who? I'm looking for Siri. That Siri. And no one can know, understand? Cyrilla is here. The girl once sought by the Lodge of Sorceresses, and practically every ruler on the continent has landed here in Velen, and I know nothing of it. What is she doing here? Indications are she's hiding from someone. I heard she quarreled with a witch, but if you don't know anything, sure you haven't seen her? I'm certain I haven't. 
But recently, someone asked me about an ashen-haired woman. He claimed she would stand out from the peasant crowd. Who was it? <laughs> Not so fast, Geralt. No humble plea. No offering for the witch. What's your rate these days? A couple dozen eggs? Three hens, maybe? My rate rises with every word you speak. I'm not sure you can afford the information anymore. Hmm. You're pricklier than I remembered. Isn't living in nature's lap supposed to be cleansing? Calming? Nature stinks. Oh, sod it. Don't give me that look. I know it's Siri we're talking about. It was an elf, this individual who asked about Cyrilla. No flea-bitten Scoyotel slob either, but an elven mage. He say what his name was? He didn't. And he wore a mask. Very secretive all around, but I liked him. He was intelligent and composed. He say what he wanted with Siri? Only that they were to meet in Velen. He wished to know if she'd arrived before he did. Did he leave any message for her? No, but he asked that were I to meet her, I should lead her to him. So you know where to find him? Yes, he said he found a hideout in some elven ruins near the village of Midcops. I'll go there with you. Why? Think I'll have trouble finding this place? I've unfinished business with this elf. He promised me something, but he never delivered it. Besides, I know you think as I do, that she might be there. And I'd like to see Cyrilla too. Let's go then. Yes, let's. Alrighty guys, so uh be Golem and Nithral time in the next episode. So I'm going to cut this as soon as we get done loading here. I don't think I'm going to do Kira's side story or anything. There's not... She doesn't have an alternative look, so it's not like um, I need to do that. This is just story-purposed and uh, alternate look. Also New Game Plus. This is the place. Been here before? No. I was hoping the elf would return as he'd promised or else his waif would appear. At any rate... I've no idea what to expect from this place. Well, let's find out. Alrighty, guys. That's going to do it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.